A local law enforcement agency has added a new member to its squad, and he's all about sniffing out crime. It was all made possible by a couple of generous Grants Pass donors. NBC 5's Nikki Torres is here now with more. Nikki? Craig, Grants Pass resident Nancy Diamisis passed away in 2015, but before her death, she and her husband decided to donate money to the Department of Public Safety. She said she loved dogs but hated drugs. With that formula in mind, she donated enough money for police to get Canine Match. Meet one of Grants Pass Department of Public Safety's newest members, Canine Officer Match. Hey, say hi. Don't be fooled by his cute looks. This is a working dog, trained to sniff for the odor of methamphetamines, cocaine, and heroin. Match is a good independent searcher, a very, very smart dog, works a lot on his own, real good, and then I just kind of clean up what he's doing areas he's missed. Canine Match's handler, Officer George Gasperson, says his dog helps find things officers may miss on scene. He's a great tool. We're looking for narcotics, controlled substances that are illegal, and uh, he'll show me right where they're at. Match's Grants Pass's first ever drug sniffing dog. When he's searching, you, you hear his nose working, you're watching his body, he's excited, and then it comes up to that odor that he's trained to find. Drop it. He'll do that stop focus, almost stops moving his entire body, and he'll do a sit. Canine match along with the training field is all thanks to Vince and Nancy Diamisis. Donated some money in order for us to uh, buy a drug dog, select a handler. The two passed away years ago, but not before donating funds to help the Grants Pass Public Safety Canine Center. She was kind of fed up always hearing about the drugs that were on our streets and affecting our community. Their donation, combining their love for dogs with their hate for drugs. They're very avid dog lovers, uh, animal activists, and they also uh, did not like the influence of drugs in our community. Just last night, the Department of Public Safety says canine match and his handler went on a deployment where he located a half ounce of heroin and 1.5 grams of cocaine during a traffic stop that led police to find a stolen gun and $1,500 in cash and evidence of distribution of narcotics. Live in studio, Nikki Torres, NBC5 News.